डिफरेंट है क्योंकि कैरेक्टर डिफरेंट है आ, अलग में जो कैरेक्टर प्ले कर रहा था वो बहुत ही अलग था आ, लेकिन ये फिल्म जो कैरेक्टर प्ले कर रहा हूँ एक हस्बैंड का किरदार है ही इज़ वेरी सोबर ही इज़ वेरी यू नो ही इज़ अथेप गाय हुज डाउन टू अर्थ बट आई थिंक द बेस्ट थिंग बाट थ्री इज यू कैन जस्ट टॉक अबाउट वन कैरेक्टर यू हैव टॉक अबाउट ऑल थ्री कैरेक्टर्स वन इज़ बेड बाई आशीष वन इज़ बेड बाई नौशीन एंड थर्ड वन इज़ मी एंड द इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ थ्री इज़ दैट इट्स बेसिकली अबाउट यू नो ऑर्डनरी पीपल placed in um i would say uh, realistic situations and how they catapult into extreme decisions or behavior i mean that's the key of three and how they react to these trials and tribulations they go through which for me as an actor was very fun because every day coming on the set you know you're allowed to have fun and go for the ride go for the you know roller coaster ride actually yeah very well husband play karo do i admire i don't know uh, i think the best uh, father figure i can say with my father um and his relationship with my mother uh both of them have i mean there's ups and downs all the time but uh, how they get through struggles is the key of any relationship and every marriage and how the husband reacts to that and takes control of the situation uh so i guess i'm with this film i began to see the other aspect of that married life you know ashish is a wonderful actor um i have always seen ashish in comedy films uh he's unfortunately or fortunately he's been typecast for the first time you were able to see him in a different limelight and that is very interesting i never expected him to perform so well in this genre because it's it's a le- you know you get you get used to something it's very hard to break it and ashish is a spectacular actor in that sense roshin is a wonderful actress um she is a true actor you know there's actors who are trained like i'm a meisner trained actor and noshin is one of those spontaneous actors you can say um but her spontaneity is is grooved into such a f- force of realism that it makes you watch it makes you it makes you, leaves you she gives you enough to keep on holding on and see what's happening next because it's an emotional drama uh because it's such an intense emotional drama the music itself serves as a purpose to not only carry on the film but you know to see the entire film is is for example is used to put a mirror in front of society and the music guides that it's able to carry the audiences to see is this is what our life is if we were put in this these situations would we react the same way so the music has helped that and i think the music is so unique in this film because you can actually after a long time feel the emotions dard jo mehsoos karte hain gaane mein isme mehsoos karunga vishal like i said before he's a gem um he gives his actors freedom thinking <laughs> they have freedom but actually he's directing him and I, like i said before he's he's a brilliant director i mean he's only 27 years old and the amount of knowledge the amount of clarity he has with his film with his scripts with his characters is unheard of i've never dealt with any director with, of that sort who's so crisp and clear with it um at the same time he's a young boy he's 27 he's younger than me so uh, for that l- looking at him i always look at him as an older brother when actually i'm older i would agree there's so many different thrillers coming but no thriller has been shot the way vishal has shot this film uh in our climax alone he has taken 56 shots and it's only me three characters so i mean can you imagine taking 56 shots over four days you know and only based on three characters how many shots can you take and i was confused when he said that what is shot sheet was saying i was like what are you doing with this and actually we do not know as actors because we have an experience such a director play, having fun and playing with angles and knowing why he wants it's one thing when a director tries to do some gimmick angle and doesn't know why he's doing it it's another thing when a director is taking a certain angle and knows knows why he's doing it because that shot taking is telling the story itself and that for me after i saw it i understood completely why he took his shots that way like i said each aspect of this film whether it be the shot taking the dop which is mr pravin but uh, vishal chiran the music has guided the story not only on an emotional basis but to tell a story on a basis to make you be in the character's shoes make you feel what they are feeling see every film i take i like to be different i like to choose things which are against the norm the reason why is that for an actor i'm very selfish so i like to explore my acting instrument i like to stretch it out and i enjoy doing different things i love experimenting because only in that you know how much you have to grow how much you have to learn growing as an actor or any art form is non stop i mean you're forever growing but these kind of things which make you work harder makes you grow faster and that's why i chose this one i just want them to go for a ride and watch the film and have fun and enjoy it. and remember it's just a film